Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So I hope you are already aware about this that the CSI NET exam, CSI June 2024 exam is postponed by NTA and now since we already know about it, there are different questions which comes in our mind. The first one being that when we can expect the next exam or when the exam will be postponed, what is the tentative date of the exam. Then the second thing is can we fill the form if we, if we missed filling the form last time or if we were not able to fill for June 2024 uh, CSINET exam form due to some reason. So will we have any option to fill the form again? Uh, then the question like what is the positive side of it and what's the negative side of it. Okay, So that's what I'm going to talk about and also one more important thing that what could be the reason why exactly this exam is postponed. So I'm going to discuss all these things in detail in this particular video. So starting with the first point that when we can expect the next CSINET exam. Okay, So see the thing is that the CSINET exam is postponed and there is no information which is officially provided by NTA. They have not provided any information that when they are going to conduct the exam. But we have to take care of this thing in mind that there is another case going on on NTA which is NEET scam. So basically they are asking to reconduct the NEET exam although NTA has not agreed to that. So the UGC NET exam is also cancelled by uh, NTA and that is also going to be reconducted. So we have to consider that also and that means that next exam after UGC NET will be CSR NET exam. So you can expect that the date for the exam will come closer to what could be the date for the UGC net exam, what could be the date for re-examination of UGC. Now again for UGC we don't have any information about it. So I can expect it to be conducted in a month. Okay, So since uh, the tentative date for CSI net exam which is which was 25th to 27th of June and after postponing it I believe that it should be conducted by the end week of July as it, it can be conducted as early as 15th of July and as late as first week of August. It should not go beyond that because if it goes beyond that, that is going to affect the next cycle of exam and that will be again a disaster. So that's what I think and if you are preparing and if you have filled the form and if you are sitting and you know waiting for the exam, so I would suggest you that you have got some extra days. You have got around a month or 15 or 20 days extra. You don't know how many days you have got. But still there are a few days which you have got so try to utilize those days effectively uh, try to you know uh, if you were not willing to prepare certain topic or if you have left certain topic while preparation now is the time when you can include that topic in your preparation and now is the time when you can think of including more topics uh, in your preparation try to practice more try to practice harder for the exam try to practice and include more topics uh, be it chemistry be it general aptitude try to include more topics in your preparation so that you are well prepared for the exam whenever it happens okay so it is for sure that the exam will be conducted it's not going to be like the csi and it will, exam will be cancelled okay so it will be conducted because you have filled the form you have almost got the city intimation slip yeah one thing which is uh, which i would say sad part that many students might have booked the tickets for their examination center because the city intimation slip was provided and they got to know that in which city they are going to have their exam center although they have not got the ad admit card yet but still many students have booked their tickets so yeah that's a loss for the student side but i don't know nta should have been more responsible in this case what's happening i can't comment on that but yeah this is seriously irresponsible behavior from nta moving ahead to the next thing that uh, what are the benefit of it and what are the demerits of it see demerits we all know because when you prepare for exam when you are mentally prepared for exam that you are going to have exam on so and so date you plan your strategies according to that and you you know strategize your preparation and you keep those days counting that this day i will do this that day i will do that and so on but when this thing happens like when the exam get postponed or something related to that happens then all your schedule all your strategy get disturbed and you have to again work upon that so that is one thing which is disheartening and again the second thing which I already said that many students might have booked their ticket so that's a financial loss which many students might have uh, come across so that's that's the sad part but the best part is that you have got few more days and one more important thing which you have got is that because now there is like people are looking into NTA like uh, they have the whole radar on them. Uh, people have eyes on NTA because of the NEET scam, because of the UGC net scam. 
so people are now looking upon nta and they are like you know they are under a particular kind of scrutiny and now i think that if there were any chances of you know uh, like there are some fishy thing happening in the csa net i think that is not going to happen and probably they will try to manage the exam more effectively and that's what they should do actually they are meant for that okay there is a organization which was made by government of india to take care of the exams and to conduct them properly and if they are not doing that uh, it's their negligence and that's sad okay so this is something good which i will say that you can be assured that whenever the exam will happen it it will be happen or it will be conducted with a 100% fair manner and uh, there would be no you know mismanagement and all that's what we are expecting and that could be the best part of this postponement of the exam now one more question is that why this exam was cancelled what could be the reason that this exam was cancelled see for ugc net we are already aware and it is uh, like it is already into the news that the paper got leaked uh, a day before the exam and that's why ugc has decided to cancel the exam csa net exam is not cancelled it is just postponed and i don't think that the paper or anything such uh, leakage of paper or something might, might have happened i think the reason for postponement of this particular exam is because nta is now right now it is involved in so many you know so many issues and uh, this, this is one organization which is taking care of so many exams and all these exams there are certain some or the other issues so just to make sure that there is no such issue which comes in for csa net exam they might have postponed it uh, that's what i believe and that's what i think it's the uh, it should be the reason for postponing this exam and also like you know they are right now answerable so to so many things to so many students to so many cases to so many things uh, for related to need and ugc net so probably that is the reason that they were not able they could not be able to you know conduct the exam in a peaceful manner for csa net and that's why they might have decided to you know postpone it for certain more days so yeah keeping all this in mind i can say that you cannot expect the exam csa net exam to be cancelled completely that is i think that is not going to happen uh, but again you can expect the exam within one month at most one month and at least as 15 days delay can be seen in the exam if any news comes related to the you know dates tentative date of the exam official notification or anything comes related to that i'll notify you over there um, on this particular youtube channel so do subscribe to it and that's all from my side for this particular video do let me know what are your opinion about uh, the exam what do you think whether it was a good decision to postpone it or they should not have postponed it do let me know in the comment section below and i will see you guys in the next one till then have a great day bye bye take care